How powerful is your sense of smell? Perhaps more powerful than you think. Smell can affect what we think and how we feel, and it can even trigger our memory. As Corey Bork reports in this week's Business Matters, there's a business at the shops at Arbor Lakes in Maple Grove that wants to make what we smell a fun and memorable experience. It's just kind of a add a little bit, stop and stir along the way, smell as you go, and just kind of create the, the perfect blend. Inside Old Factory's scent studio in Maple Grove, noses are put to work. It's where we find Gracie Clem and Summer Olson trying to balance a few of their favorite smells to make into a candle. I chose watermelon, sunflower, and cherry blossom. It kind of has like a summer and fruity like smell to it which is what kind of I'm going for. Here a few are selected out of many, more than 130 to be exact, all different scents. Oh, it smells so good. That can be mixed and made into something memorable and distinct. I created the smell, I picked it out from, I don't know how many there are there, but, um, and this is like exactly what I wanted. The idea for a scent store came from Sue Brady. I have always liked scent. The former scientist thought of it after she met a person on the East Coast who sold natural soy candles and premium fragrances. My whole goal is just to have a place people can come. Um, you know, you have friends in town, you have a group outing, a corporate outing, um, just something that you can come do. So what are the most popular scents? Kind of depends on the time of year. Right now, I think even year round, um, <laughs> champagne is always popular. Or the scent people can't believe. Bacon. <laughs> so we do have bacon. There's even a scent for old books. And that got me thinking of my favorite smells. But I needed a little help to start. It sounds funny, but the first thing you do when you're blending scents together is it's a visual. And my visual? is a drink at the beach. So we give everybody a clipboard here and introduce them to the scent walls. Store scent master Allie Palm helps me select the rest. Like the mango. Yeah, cool, Let's write it down. Of course, I couldn't choose everything. Our goal is to narrow it down to two or three. Um, we think of it like painting, you know, you add too many colors, sometimes you end up with you can't really smell anything. So after a little sniffing. And it does smell like ginger ale. And winnowing. <laughs> we'll pass on key lime. I have to say no to something, right? Yeah. I had my mix. Mango, coconut, and champagne. Then I just had to blend. And I have them in order of most intense to least intense. Smell. I'm trying to envision my beach. And stir. And voila. I created my own beach. I like it. Coconuts came through really yeah. well, yeah. For Business Matters, on the beach, Cory Bork. CCX News. Looks good. You can also make your own personal candles, room fresheners, and much more.